Bună ziua, dragii mei elevi! Bine ați venit la lecția 8 de limba engleză pentru clasele a 7 și a 8 -a. Înainte de a începe, vă rog să acordați timpul necesar acestui curs, să aveți implicarea necesară, să aveți dispoziția necesară pentru a asculta și a viziona până la sfârșit exercițiile. Că ce altfel de mare folos nu o să vă fie ce, ce veți viziona într-un timp atât de scurt. De asemenea, vă amintesc că pe acest canal găsiți cursuri de limba română pentru toate clasele, asemenea și cursuri de engleză, rubricile, povești pentru copilași drăgălași, rubrica pentru tine, doamna mea, și rubrica din înțelepciunea lumii, pentru că acest canal este gratuit. Ca să-l pot menține gratuit în continuare și după începerea anului școlar, când vom lucra din fiecare manual școlar la engleză și la română, fiecare lecție în parte, fiecare exercițiu în parte, cu explicații și cu rezolvare, am nevoie de ajutorul vostru, adică de cât mai mulți abonați. Altfel va trebui să fac abonamente și nu-mi doresc pentru că vreau să lucrați gratuit, cât de mult posibil, în loc să plătiți sume colosale la meditații. Numărul meu de telefon este 0773889705. Cele două pagini de exerciții pe care le vom... Ba nu, nu, una singură lucrăm. Pagina de exerciții pe care o vom lucra astăzi este aceasta, două sunt prea multe și ar fi prea lungă ora. Uitați, dragilor, vă rog frumos să faceți captură de ecran. Da? Pagina aceasta este. Facem captură de ecran ca să avem exercițiile în fața ochișorilor. Bine ar fi să le și scrieți. <coughs> so, let's start our lesson. Exercise number one. Rewrite the sentences, putting the adverb in brackets in the correct place. Number one. I seldom, the first sentence is I go to bed after midnight and the adverb in brackets is seldom. I seldom go to bed after midnight. 2. I don't drink tea in the morning. The adverb is often. I don't drink tea in the morning often. Or I don't often drink tea in the morning. Number 3. She washes the dishes after dinner. The adverb is usually. She usually washes the dishes after dinner. Number three, I eat in restaurants. The adverb is rarely. I rarely eat in restaurants. Number five, do they go for a walk on Sunday afternoons? The adverb is often. Do they often go for a walk on Sunday afternoons? 6. Do you visit your grandparents on Saturdays? The adverb is usually. Do you usually visit your grandparents on Saturdays? 7. Mary is late for meetings. The adverb is never. Mary is never late for meetings. 8. They don't go abroad on holiday. They don't go abroad on holiday usually. Or they don't usually go abroad on holiday. Exercise number 2. Put the verbs in brackets into the present simple or the present continuous. 1. Excuse me, what time does the bus for Plymouth leave? This is A. B. It leaves in half an hour. Are you going to Plymouth too? A. Yes, I am. I am, yes, I am visiting my grandparents. My, gr oh. Yes, I am visiting my granddaughter. She lives there. And you? B. 
I live there too. I do a course at the college. A. What subject do you study? B. Tourism. A. That's interesting. B. I come here twice a week because I'm working in a hotel at the moment. It's work experience. A. Yes, I think that is very important. Do you like the work? B. Yes, I love it. Ah, look, here comes the bus. Exercise number three. Put the verbs in brackets into the past simple or the past continuous. One. He was watching TV when the telephone rang. Two. I was cleaning the house while he was working in the garden. 3. When we found the cat, it was playing under the bed. 4. Joanne was having a shower when the window cleaner came. <coughs> 5. Just a moment. <coughs> my voice. Number five. Grandma was knitting while granddad was smoking his pipe. Six. When I arrived home, father was painting the front door. Seven. Bob and Sally were walking when it started to rain. Eight. What were you talking about when I came in? 9. I was reading my newspaper when they knocked the door. 10. As Fiona was washing the glass, she cut her finger. 11. Mother broke the vase while she was dusting it. 12. My brother was building a sand castle while I was swimming in the sea. Exercise number four. Put the verbs in brackets into the past simple or the present perfect simple. <clears throat> Well-known pop singer Zippy Spring has recently signed a new record deal with Star Records in London. Zippy's success has begun five years ago when he has recorded a song which has gone on the top of the charts. However, he has had an accident six months ago and he stayed in bed for a long time. He made his first public appearance three weeks ago, and thanks his fans for their love and support. The music he plays has been popular with older people since the beginning of his career, but recently younger people have started to take an interest too. Zippy only signed the deal last week, but he has already written a number of songs for his new record. He has just announced that he has started to plan his next European tour. Aceasta a fost lecția noastră de astăzi. Mulțumesc pentru participare și repet rugămintea de a vă abona. De asemenea, îmi puteți lăsa like-uri dacă considerați că este util cursul. Evident, ca orice om mă mai ne... Na, probabil că mai fac și câte o greșeală, fiindcă suntem supuși greșeli, azi am avut o zi grea. Oricum, ne vedem la cursul următor, până atunci vă doresc vacanță plăcută în continuare și nu uitați să mai deschideți din când în când acest canal. La revedere!